well it has been forever i don't think after college or after first year of my job that is in 2013 i went to sirodni to shop well largely because i did not have the time and i got into online shopping but having said that very recently i visited sirodni nagar and it was like oh my god sare bachpan ke you know yaade taza ho gayi uh, the reason why i actually stopped shopping from sirodni nagar is because i am a medium to large size in sirodni otherwise i am a medium size or a uk 12 or uk 10 depending on the brands that i choose to wear the problem with sirodni is that they have a huge variety and lots of options for women who are either too petite who are extra small or small I mean I do envy them because of the variety that they have uh, in our case usually what happens is I pick up a dress come home and realize that it's too tight a shirt that I really like I come home not buttoning up properly maybe because I'm slightly <clears throat> so today I'm going to show you a mix of some things that I picked up for myself is the first thing that I picked up from Sarojini is the sequin top it's a balloon shape ombre top uh, that has gray here right under the neck and then there's a beautiful baby pink or rather rose quartz there's a beautiful detailing of sequin uh this i picked up because i really like but it was actually a size bigger to me so the way i generally wear it is with a pair of tights and probably team up a nice denim jacket on top and so only this floral top look at it it's a nice sleeveless floral top with some nice detailing of sequin work around the neckline Um I picked it up because of the colors that it's got it's got all shades of pink and I'm a big pink holder. Uh even when I wear it it was looking very nice and it's got this white base so pretty nice and I got this for about 250 bucks. Okay the next top that I got is this maroon peplum lace top. Uh I think this is the only top that actually fits me to perfection. Zyada loose bhi nahi hai nor even too tight. I loved it for its color. It's got this nice masala color but see it's Rodney has quality issues. You can see that you know there are a lot of thread work that have not been cut properly but that's how I could bargain and I bought this for like 200 bucks. Can be a little bit of task for women who are medium to large size according to their brand and the clothes that they've got. That's because A, you cannot really wear the clothes on top because you're either too busty yourself or you're wearing layers and stuff. Like I do, I I generally avoid trying clothes. I just put them and I see how the measurement is from the bust area, how the measurement is from shoulders. If I think that it's going to fit me, I take it. But if I think that it's slightly small, I keep it because slightly small when you wear it is going to be a lot more smaller. So this is how I got the top from them. This is a very nice purple uh, shirt style. That's actually just got uh, the area until the bustier, and then it opens from the torso. This is one of my most favorite tops. Love, love, love. This is for four hundred bucks, but I think it's worth the money because of the quality that's got. It's so much more better than the other brand. Next is a nice cutwork T-shirt. It's a blue cutwork T-shirt with pink color. Not that it's not. Rare to find. It's a pretty common T-shirt, but I like to wear it on top of my jeans or for my yoga class. Here comes the only dress that I got, but guys, it's tight. <laughs> it's a nice cutwork dress, pink color dress that I got it's from some brand called Red Tag. It's UK cut. I love it. It's so pretty, though. See the beautiful cutwork detailing it's got on the arms. It's got a nice zip at the back, and it's a straight A line, like a body hugging, like a typical body hugging dress. I saw the same skirt on another online portal that I really shop from, and this is the same mint color skirt. High, what is this? Low rise, high low rise skirt. Yeah, it's got this nice slit which is in the front, but I love it because of its color and it fit me. This is something that I could try on easily. Um, I've got it, but I don't know where will I wear it. Holiday, but it's a nice skirt, and that I've seen it online as well. So yeah, no, I forgot. There's another top that I picked up. This is a super common top now. It's a kimono style top that's got some nice thread embroidery on the yoke. So I like it because it's so free and so flowy. But this is a super common top, so I don't know if I'm going to be wearing it probably at home. That I got from Sarojini Hall. It's this beautiful sequin clutch. I have been looking to find a copper color sequin clutch. This clutch has got this beautiful metallic chain that I love. Uh, but what I like about it is that it's so versatile color that it will go with everything: golden, brown, silver, any tones of color. And it's got this beautiful pink, um, beautiful pink cover inside. 
pretty decent that way. This was for 500 rupees. I did try to bargain a lot, but uh, this was the only piece in copper. So the reason why they were not, you know, giving it to me for more cheaper price was because of the color. The golden one, on the other hand, was for 300 bucks. I mean, I could bargain it to 300 bucks. But this was slightly expensive <laughs> from Saroojni standards, but I love it, and I think it's gonna go with a lot of my outfits. Last product that I got from my Saroojni haul is this super different boho neck piece. Um, I like it because it's not very common. I have not seen this anywhere else. I like it. I like it for its color. See, it's even going with the current top that I'm wearing. Yeah, so it's pretty nice that way. I know a lot of you are already aware on how to shop at Sarojini Nagar and those from Delhi are probably this ass at shopping at Sarojini. Um, but for girls who are bigger size like me, who are tall, like I'm 5'7 and a half and when I put dresses on on myself or when I put rompers, they're really, really, really short. I mean, they're super short. Well, they're really cute but they're super short. So that way it's girls who are a little not as tall as I am or too petite, they have an advantage. but. Um, the thing that I would recommend is that every top that you take, please measure it from your shoulders and from your bust more than your waist area uh, and uh, lastly do give importance to the length of the skirt, length of the dress or the romper that you're buying. Uh, put it on yourself, make sure that you know the shoulder matches your shoulder and then you measure it from your knee level how short or how long it is. Um, for me, mostly the ones that I like are really short clothes so I happen to give it a pass but if you're lucky you will get something for your size. Um, bargain, 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 that's the only funda that works. They have generally priced, you know, their products between 400, 500 rupees and bhaiya log are not going to be there now that Sarojini is undergoing construction. But even at shops, you know, they have priced the products between 500, 600 and you can bring it down to 200, 300 rupees. Uh, I did this haul much before Sarojini was being shut down, as in before the whole change of the process were happening. Um, I do not know of the current status but I think I have got enough dope for the coming few months because I do have a size problem there so yeah um, but if you guys like what I picked up then do not forget to give a big thumbs up make sure that you subscribe to my channel I have a lot more haul idea but I do not know if you guys would be interested to see whether it's for makeup I was thinking of doing a makeup uh, video for my wedding all the makeup that I have shopped for so far in case you want to see that, then do subscribe to my channel and do drop your comments and let me know I'll film that for you. See you guys until next time. Mwah.